Welcome back to Jimmy's promo and today we'll be talking about the updated AR emoji studio which is actually really cool inside of Samsung One UI 3.0 to where they actually create some really cool videos for you and also some audio that comes with all of this that you're able to set up for your lock screen as well as your your call display so if someone calls you then you can see something like this you can also move your person around uh, this is the one that I use currently right now on my lock screen and it's actually super hilarious because what happens is that by the time that I I basically lift up my phone uh, my little AR emoji is already running towards me right here and boom usually by the time that happens then my phone unlocks just because of the facial recognition on the top so these are actually really fun that you're able to use again uh, if you would like to set this up for your lock screen um, it's pretty fun and, 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 and really cool to take a look at so how to set this one up what you want to do is I have the AR emoji studio as its own icon that is set up you know either in my application tray I can move it to the home screens but how you're able to get this added in is when you go inside of your camera what you want to do is scroll all the way over where it says more so once you go inside of more then you go to AR zone on the top right hand side now inside of AR zone this is what you see here you can do like AR doodle and a whole bunch of other really cool things as well you can make your own clothes things like that but on the top right hand side inside of settings you tap that and you hit this option here which is add AR zone icon uh, to the apps screen so once you do that then you can open up the AR studio here uh, this is where you can go through you can make one so this is going to be your main home page right here if I tap this icon there it's going to show me some of the emojis that I've created so that's the little dude this is myself I can delete one I can also add another um, and then also too on the very top right hand side you can go inside of settings but you don't really need to look at that when you open this up here you can make your own stickers you can take another pic you can design some clothes and you can edit your emojis so if you go through and you notice that you want to update the clothes or, or change a hairstyle, change a beard, something like that. Maybe your physical appearance also change. You'd be able to update yourself there. Then as you scroll up here, this is where you can create a video. You can set something up for your call screen and then the lock screen. So down here, we're not going to go in depth on any of these, but I do want to let you know that you can go through this stuff here. Uh, and learn a little bit of what you're able to do with your AR emoji. Now, some people think that this thing needs a refresh. I just think it's pretty cool. It's a little junk little thing that just makes you kind of happy and laugh sometimes. Um, you can go to different clothing here. You got like a Hawaiian shirt, denim jackets. I mean, there's so many things you could do. You can design your own clothes. So I did this on a video in the past. I put my own logo on a bunch of things. Um, it's pretty fun. You could also take a look at some new stickers if you wanted to have some of these stickers you know relate over into your AR emoji you also have these little uh, things you can push up on little stickers inside of all of your different you know images things like that uh, let's see you can explore with your emoji I've shown that off before too you can mirror your your movements and a whole bunch of other things and then on the bottom uh, you can get new emojis so if you wanted to add some of these characters uh, you can do this as well too and then you can actually put two people into into one screen so actually what I did earlier was I went inside of one of these categories and I wanted to create my own sticker. So then this way I can do something with uh, me and Elliot at the exact same time. So uh, he was sitting over here, I was over here and you can do a whole bunch of really cool things. Um, maybe I'll do that for another video in the future, but I really just mostly want to talk about the call screen and lock screen. So with the call screen, it's pretty fun. You just tap on call screen right there. You tap on any of these and a lot of these do, you know, have music. So just make sure you tap there. So this way you can hear what all this is. Now, the first time that you see some of these, um, you will have to kind of, you know, let it load, let it kind of, you know, save and cache to your phone. So this is why they're playing instantly on my phone. And the moment you first do it, I like this one. <laughs> this one's pretty cool. Um, you can move your person around. So if you have your date and time somewhere else on your lock screen or whatever, a call screen. So a lot of times it'll show like answer and, and decline. So I might, might want to move him right up over here. So this way it makes sense. But yeah, so you can kind of go through, you can just play with a bunch of these. Now, once you have this one set up, let's say that we do, let's just say we do this one right here. So you hit on save. And so now it's just gonna save the, this video basically to your phone. So this way it's going to add it into uh, the call background. But I guess since we're kind of at this point in this video, if you guys are appreciating this video, you guys like tips, tricks, tutorials on, on your latest Samsung devices, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell for notifications to so get notified for all future videos. And it, uh, as well too, give this thing a big thumbs up if you do like it because it does help YouTube push this video to more people. The YouTube algorithm is pretty crazy. So again, uh, like this video if you guys are appreciating it so far. 
Now over here, you can select this option here that with that video that you guys just got done seeing, there is audio. So you can actually set this video sound as the ringtone. So if you have a ringtone you like, you can leave it. But if you want to use the audio that was coming with this video, you select this option and you just use you, uh, you know, set as call backgrounds. Now, when it comes down to the lock screen, you guys have already seen uh, the one that I was using. So let's say that you wanted you to use this one here. This was the video that I leaked out a long time ago before this phone was even press released. I showed off some of the really cool things I was able to do. This was the video that was there. And then they just went through and added in all the rest of these. So I believe this was the video that I kind of liked. So I'm going to move this one right up over here. Uh, I'm going to go through, I'm going to hit on save. And so now this one's going to be now my new uh, lock screen video. So you can simply just go through, you can change these back and forth. It's actually really fun. And I guess maybe since we kind of got the bulk of this video kind of out of the way in terms of setting this up, you know, with your call background and with your lock screen, I guess I might as well show you really fast what you're able to do with two people. So let's say that you go right up over here and you go to make stickers. So inside of these stickers here, okay, it looks like I have to update my current look because I did actually update this a little bit. So in order for me to make my own custom stickers, I'm going to go right there to that option there. I'm going to select this image right here. And I'm also going to do, uh, let's see, actually, I'm going to do this one right here. So this is me right over there on the left hand side, uh, this little Elliot on the right hand side. Then uh, what you can do is on the bottom, you can choose if you want a background. So you can do a regular, you know, uh, photo from your gallery in the back, or you can do something like this. Now, what you are able to do is you can move around like this. And then if you use two fingers, you can make them bigger, smaller, and also with two fingers, then you would be able to rotate them. So I'm pretty sure, um, actually, let me get out of this image here. I'm going to go right here. Uh, so with Elliot, I'm going to move him to you know kind of look at me and then when i switch over to myself i'm going to move myself this way i'm going to use two fingers uh, i can make myself a little bit shorter but then i'm going to make myself kind of look over at him then from here you can choose whatever you want each one to do so for me maybe i'll just do something very simple like this uh, and then uh, for my movement we can do something like this so <laughs> we can dance uh, and then for him uh, for his facial you know face uh, i guess we could just do something like this like wow Wow. <laughs> and then uh, what we can make him do is uh, maybe a different type of dance. So we can make him do one of these. Uh, we can make him do one of these. So he's like literally copying me uh, or he can just, you know, clap at me. So in this way, you can just hit on save and then now you're creating your own little sticker or GIF. It's actually really fun and really cool that you're able to do, you know, some of the stuff here. So that little image right there, I'd be able to send off to really anybody and everybody so on the bottom it has a couple options that i can add this to my gallery i can add it to my always on display i can set it as a profile picture um, on the top right over here i just hit on share and then i can share it in any way that i want so it's going to send us as a sticker or as a gif you know depending on where you put it uh, it's going to be pretty fun and really cool for people to take a look at and again people will notice that that's him and that's me and it's again really 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 fun but that's pretty much it for today's video hope you guys kind of like that the ar emoji studio is something that is pretty fun that you can play with if you've never played with it yet you might as well just do it it is actually pretty fun but i hope you guys have liked this video if you guys did please give this thing a huge thumbs up don't forget to hit subscribe subscribe right over here in the very bottom left hand side and if you like this video then more than likely you'll also like this video and i'll see you guys later